Jason. Jason, how you doing? Doing good. Can you can you believe you're you're facing your last regular season college football game? Did it seem like it just crept up all of a sudden, or do you feel like you've been playing forever? Just kind of what are your thoughts and emotions knowing this? And this is the last game you're promised. Um, it feel like it's been a long journey, but it feel like it went by fast at the same time. So it's really exciting, and I feel like I did a good job in my career. So I'm proud. You guys talked about this being kind of a must-win game, obviously, to be bowl eligible. What's been your guys' mindset going into to this game and off the practice last night? Um, it's another game, another opportunity. So we want to get a bowl game. Every every game means a lot. So we want to get, definitely get that. What do you, do you want UCF fans to most remember about you? Um, just how hard I worked and how hard I went on the field. And I, I gave them all every game. That's the main thing. Just talking about giving your all every game. I mean, I've lost track the amount of times I've looked at games and see you're on the field for every snap. Yeah. I mean, I, I don't know. Obviously, you're coming, you know, from a lower level. Often you're trying to prove yourself at FPS and Big 12. Do you kind of felt like you, you did that, that you proved you could compete at the highest level of college football? Oh, yeah, I did it. And every, wherever I went, I, I did it. So I feel like I, I competed on every level and played at a high level wherever I went. So definitely. When you look back at the film the last two weeks, where do you feel like you guys have made the biggest improvements um, from week to week in the Oklahoma State game and then this past week with the Texas Tech game? Um, we definitely like we better with our alignments and communication and just a lot of fits and pass coverage. We did a lot better job over the last two weeks. I would say there's still memories to be made, but here at UCF the last two years, what will you remember the most? Are there any favorite memories or standout moments? Uh, there's been a lot of them. I know definitely the two space games, definitely memorable. Um, when we beat Cincinnati last year, that was one of them. And I just love practice and having our meetings and stuff like that. So. Defensively, you guys had to face another big running back last week with, with uh, Tosh Brooks. What do you guys need to do to keep getting better in that rush defense and, and contain some of those teams? Uh, we definitely got to fit, fit up the run better and tackle better. So that, that's really the main two things. So, yeah. When you look at film, what stands out about Houston to you? Um, they got some players that play hard. and they, They're a good team, so we can't take them lightly. So they're definitely a good team. You talk about you enjoy things like practice and meetings. Who are some of the special people that you know you've developed friendships with over the last couple of years? Guys that you'll probably be in touch with 10, 20 years from now. You think? Um, Walter Yates, yeah, he one of them. Uh, Andrew Harris and T.J. Bullet, they like my two little brothers, so they they're gonna be really good in the future. So yeah, them like the main people. Yeah, well, tell us a little bit about those guys because obviously linebacker is gonna be wide open. You and Walter, this yep. is your last year, so we're gonna see. Brand new linebackers next year. Tell us about some of these younger guys like Andrew Harris. Um, Andrew, he's like, he, he's legit. He like, he's got to learn, like learn the play and stuff like that. He's gonna be really good. He like, he's super fast, strong. He's one of the strongest on the team. Being honest, yeah, he's he gonna be really good. TJ, he works super hard. He got a bright future. Does going to a bowl game is that what's necessary for this to be considered a successful season? Um, yeah, at this point, yeah, that's basically what we aim for. You know, it, it haven't went how we wanted wanted it to go, but that definitely would be a success. You talked about some of the some of the up and comers on this team. How, how important is it for them having maybe gone through gone through the bowl experience before? How important is it for them to get those extra practices, kind of build on this first year of Big Twelve, moving moving into next season? Um, it's definitely just it's just like a more opportunities for them to just get better, just learn to learn the plays and get more experience for next season. So it's going to be really good for the younger guys. Jason, once the season wraps up, what what are your plans? Obviously, to more play NFL. I mean, what what do you what do you need to do? You gonna get an agent, a trainer, all those kind of things to get prepared? Oh yeah, I'm gonna get an agent. Uh, I'm gonna start training, train for the combine and pro day and stuff like that. So definitely focus focus on that after the season. How many people will you have for, uh, for the weekend's festivities, and what's that gonna be like to play for a big part of family, friends, all that? Um, I think maybe at least ten. So I think it's gonna be fun playing. Watch my, well, my family coming in and watching me play my last game here, so it's going to be really exciting. What does UCF mean to you? Um, it means a lot, you know. It really it really changed my life when I came here, so it, mean, it means everything to me. I, it, I had, when I left EIU, it was a big opportunity for me to come here, and I feel like I came and did what I had to do. So. How do you feel like you're a different person now than when you first got on this campus? Uh, I, really, I don't really change. I'm really the same same person. so. I ain't really changed much.
obviously it's a big week. This is the last game for sure on, on the schedule. You got to win to get to a bowl. So as a senior, do you talk to the guys? I mean, I'm sure they don't need to be told much, but just how important is it to get that one extra game to make this a successful season? Uh, I mean, it's really a, really important. If you love football, every game is important. So you want to play as much as you can because you never know when it's going to be your last game. Thanks, Jason. Thanks,